Drekovac In Solovic mythology, the Drekovac appears as a very scary looking demon that, in reality, is the ghost of an unbaptized child's soul. Its appearance varies depending on who sees it since it is so horrifying, that few can stare at it long enough to give a proper description. The creepiest description so far, is without a doubt the one where the Drekovac, appears in the form of an undead child who begs and calls for people passing near the cemetery to baptize it. Abaddon Abaddon is a demon that we are introduced to in the book of Revelation. In Hebrew his name means place of destruction while in ancient Greek it translates to destroyer. In most theological texts, excluding the Bible, Abaddon is depicted as the demon of destruction, a dominant figure of the apocalypse, and one of the chief demons of hell that in many cases refuses to obey even Satan. However, Abaddon, according to Christian tradition, is described as the king of the bottomless pit that holds lost souls and is the leader of a vicious plague of locusts. One way or another, he's one scary demon and that's the only thing all cultures and religions that know his name can agree on. Malthus If this collection of demons has not freaked you out yet, then, Malthus is the one to do the trick. The mighty great president of hell is second in command, behind Satan, and has 40 legions of demons under his control. He can reveal your desires and destroy them, will fool you with good familiar spirits, and will finally betray you, but only after he has accepted your blood sacrifice. Description of Malthus from a possessed person. She said. Malthus appears to me with very dark hair, a goatee, and piercing green eyes. His aura is pure demonic blue, it's enormous, the first time I caught a glimpse of Malthus's aura. I saw the room fill with his aura, it was immense, within a split second it was all over. Malthus, is incredibly powerful. The first time I successfully invoked him I felt like I had the power to take on the whole world and then the energy and physical strength he gave me was incredible, and even a fraction of Malthus's power and strength. Pasazu If you've heard of Pasazu at all, it's because you paid attention while watching The Exorcist. The Sazu, was the demon that possessed young Regan in the film. However, this fascinating character has a long history that goes back several centuries. This particular demon god is often depicted as being partially human. The rest of his frame, though, is fleshed out with a scorpion's tail, falcon's talons, two sets of wings, and a fierce lion's head. With an appearance like that, it's no wonder ancient people alternated between fearing him, 